Okay, Star Shalomin, I'm just making a quick reply video based on, you know, what we've already talked about, you know, here. You know, this business about the Bible counting the start of Passover, that's where I'm hung up. Okay, and of course, you know your own video. This is your Spanish version of what you'd already published. And it's, it's interesting the way, you know, it's nice, slow Spanish. I appreciate that. Okay, but I want to show you what the, the issue here I'm having is. You already know your own diagram there, so I don't need to explain that. Okay, we start at, you know, the month starts in Aviv, a.k.a. Nisan now, post-exile. All right. Passover starts on the 14th. That's 14 days after the vernal equinox. You and I both understand that. Say the same thing. Okay, fine. The count of the Omer... Um, is really supposed to start piggyback on the last day of Passover, which is the 21st. That's in Numbers 28, 26. I don't remember if we agree on that. But, you know, if we need to talk it, talk it over, we can talk it over. The bottom line is, is that since the counting of the Omer starts then, Pentecost is 50 days after Passover week. All right, so if I add Passover week to it, then you're talking about a total of 57 days to Pentecost from the beginning, you know, Passover night, because that's the new day, right? I'll call it the 14th as a solar day, but it's really the 15th, you know, because Jewish time begins at sundown. All right, so, and I, I get screwed up sometimes with my ones. So, you know, correct me if you think I'm wrong, but if I go starting on the 14th solar day, okay, and I add 7, I may need to call that the 15th, I get obviously 21. Okay, and by what you're saying here, over here with the, the 31 days, is that really Nissan is supposed to run 31 days, not 30. That's Nisan, Ziv, and then Sivan, okay, with past, with uh, Pentecost occurring in Sivan. All right, so I've got 21, whoops, 21 plus 10 to take me to the 31st of Nisan, by what you're saying here. Okay, so that is the 31st. That my count, though, from Passover is 7 plus 10, right? I got 7 days of Passover plus 10 days from the 21st to the 31st in order to close out Nisan. Okay, so after that the calculation gets simpler. Okay, so if we're kind of 57 days, then we now have Ziv to count, so we add in another 31 by what you're saying here, and that gets me to 48 which would make, which would leave seven, well, no, um, minus uh, 57. I got nine more days. So on the ninth of, ninth of Sivan, I will be coming up with Pentecost as of the ninth of Sivan, not the 11th. In other words, the insertion of those additional days in those first two months makes Pentecost happen earlier on its calendar. In other words, I was coming up with 11 to 12, you know, Sivan, based on 30-year day, 30-month, 30 30-day 30 months, rather than 31. Okay, so that would be saying that 57 days takes you to a Pentecost equal to 9 Sivan going by your calendar. All right, now there are another 57 days between um, Pentecost and 9th Ave when the temple goes down twice. The first one we can document it is really going down on the 10th, which is in Jeremiah 52. And I can look up the exact verse if you want. Um, whereas the second time it goes down is really by a report, you know, when Titus took it down. He started on Passover and he ended on 9th Ave, which on the calendar that we say today, which is not necessarily true, uh, was August 28th and 29th of 70 AD. 
um, that August date I got from uh, Military History Magazine, a December 1995 issue. There are other places, but that's just a citation that comes to my mind immediately. Okay, so let's test that. We got how many days to 9th Av from Pentecost? If Pentecost is the 9th of Sivan, all right, then we got 31 days in Sivan minus 9. So we got 22 days left in Sivan. Then you got Sivan plus Tammuz. That's 53, and nine more days, I mean 53, and then to get to 57, there's only four more days. So that would be the fourth of Av rather than the ninth of Av. So, I mean, that's the problem I've got with it is that um, Moses, Isaiah, Daniel using 58s instead of 57, Paul and even Mary in the Magnificat are all making an issue of 56, which is the number of days between Passover start and Pentecost. The number of days between Pentecost start and 9th Ave. And we know the temple really went down on Solar Day 9th Ave, 10th day, you know, because it's in the you know afternoon. Um per Jeremiah at least the first time if not the second so we're we're coming up here with four days short of that so the doctrinal significance of 56 is not fitting with this idea that well Israel measured her calendar you know like you say here in the first Tekufat all right of uh, 31 days per month in the first three months of the year it's not fitting that and it's not fitting the, the 31 days in the second three months. I mean, I understand what you're trying to get to. You're saying, you're, you're pointing out that, hi, there's 186 days between the vernal equinox here and the autumnal equinox here. And I get that. And it makes sense that, that God would time it that way. The problem is, is that it's not conforming to the other dates that we got in the Bible. And I don't know how to resolve that. End the video.